Douglas and, and George Baker and up front it will be Will Gibbons and Bailey. Four, Tyrese Brown. Number five, Phil Mc McCurdy. Six, Corey Carruthers. Tilbury again just looking to try and uh, give the ball back into Smith who's taken the initial throw but the ball's nipped away and now McGurk. McGurk with the ball out to May over on the far side. Good save by Harrison. First time effort there. They can't make the ball stick and again City will come forward and now Baker with a little bit of space. Ball inside to Taylor Randall who has space to move into. Taylor Randall with a right foot shot, brings a good save out of goalkeeper Smith. A few good balls over the top and the kick from Smith straight into the feet of Berger who takes on Curtis Smith well over on that far side. Managed to get the wrong side of Smith and it goes down under a tackle to free kick. You have to feel Stuart Hendry will be looking to flash this one across the face of goal. Cross into the boxes. Initially looked like it's going to be met by McGurk. Ball comes out to Verma and misses it. Chance there, at stri strike there. And it's 1 0 Warsaw. A strike from Caden May. Bounced up in the six yard box of Worcester. Into the feet of Taylor Randall. Taylor Randall now moving into the moving into the Warsaw would have. Pass out to Baker over on the left hand side. Baker now into the box for Worcester. Cross across the face of goal. Goes Bailey full of chance and headed away by McCurdy there. It was a good effort on goal there by Bailey Fulham. Smith, Smith's clearance is initially headed on by Carruthers and Hendry going down under a, a pullback there I think from Taylor Randall and the referee's given another free kick to Warsaw Wood inside the Worcester half. Brown with the taking the free kick short to uh, Campbell who happened to give the ball ahead of him to Verma who was on the charge now getting to the, we're into the, the city box for Warsaw Wood. Good plays broken up well there by Curtis Smith, but his pass out to Bailey Fuller isn't a good one and gives the ball back to Walsall Wood. Across the walls, back post. Chance again for Walsall Wood, hits the back post, Caden May. Lovely little cross to the back post by Jay Verma. Caden May unmarked to double Walsall Wood's advantage. All City headed into the Walsall Wood half. So long ball over the top and releases Bailey Fuller into a little bit of space. Bailey Fuller now over the far right hand side. A little bit of skill and able to take on take on Campbell. The tackle came in there from McCurdy and it wasn't a good tackle. It's a very tight angle, but yeah, I think Jamie Smith, the left footed free kick, left footed. Goal kick. Yeah, Carruthers now is able to come back into play and the header from Mafosa under a little bit of pressure there from McGurk. Corner into the box and it was aimed for, for McGurk and his, his header down into Brown. Now it's Montero on the edge of the box, just looking to get a bit of space and he moves that one all the way back out back out towards Hendry. Hendry's holding the ball in, comes back in onto his left foot and cross towards the back post. Header won by McGurk towards goal and it's a header on from McGurdy. No flag from the linesman and City in the first half finding themselves 3-0 down. Back. Jamie Smith with the ball into Sam Witten just uses his positioning to let the ball run past Campbell. Cross into the box from Witten. And this time the referee has given a free kick. George Baker whips the ball into the, into the box of Worcester. Mafos with the header out to Bailey Fuller. Chance it for a shot and goal. It's closed down and blocked well. But And Bailey Fuller by the looks of things. So real change up here in the in the second half of Worcester. All three substitutes made and already under a bit of pressure there from Carruthers with the ball to the edge of the box to Hendry. Hendry now out wide to Verma. Verma putting up putting inside of his left foot. Take off the line by Smith, only goes as far as May. There's Jamie Smith's left foot across into the box to the near post, but it's dealt with by Carruthers to the edge of the area to Taylor Randall. Taylor Randall now on the edge of the Warsaw Wood box on the right hand side. Left foot across towards the back post, headed by Mafosa, just wide a goal. Little drag back by Monteith as he goes down under some pressure as the ball was looking like it was going to be breaking away. He's got a lovely left foot on him as he does get a shot towards goal. Just flies past the top corner. And Douglas with the throw for Worcester into the feet of Austin Evening. Uh, nice little turn by him. Did have to cut back inside though in. Douglas now with the ball into Taylor Rounder. Taylor Rounder with a lovely ball over the top. Good first touch by Muirhead. Chance for Worcester. Well they've got one back. Lovely ball over the top into the feet of Archie Muirhead who slotted through the legs of Callum Smith there to make it to, to get one back for Worcester. Smith elects to clear this one out of his hands and a bit of a coming together there between McGurk and Smith. And it is a head in, it's, it's a head injury so the referee's going to have to stop it. 
Taylor Andle and Mifosa are on their on their toes, waiting for that ball to be dropped to to May and the referee has got this back underway and May into the feet of Hendry. Hendry now on the edge of the, the box of Waterwood. Lovely ball over the top. For, for Jay Verma, it was a lovely scoop ball over the top from Stuart Hendry. Worcester to salvage in this game as Smith takes the goal kick. Ball one way in the air there by McGurk, but the foes are cut again. Clears long for Worcester and something for, for Muirhead to run on to as he holds this one up and again he's just got Camel Campbell just ahead of him. Checks back inside to his left foot with the ball to the edge of the box. Cam Monteith now gets a shot of a goal. Well there is a, there is another consolation goal for Worcester. Brilliant play there by uh, Muirhead over on the, the right hand side. Ball forward by Harrison and flicked on by Baker. Baker now with the ball uh, in, into the feet of Monty. Uh, Muirhead just trying to wriggle free and get a little bit of a uh, space there. He's gone down right on the edge of the area. Smith's free kick just fizzed past the, the top corner earlier in the second half. Well, this is a big chance for Wolfstrom. I don't know how much that long he's added on. Jamie Smith left footed free kick. Goal! Great free kick from Jamie Smith and it's 4-3! 92 minutes, 40 seconds on the clock. And has Jamie Smith just Come given something for Worcester to fight for in the last few seconds? Worcester will pu push everything forward in search of a point here as Harrison pumps the ball back up the pitch. Flick on there by Osadibi. It, it breaks for Taylor Randall. Taylor Randall now moving towards the goal, but he goes down under a bit of pressure there. Referee waves, no foul as Worcester would look to come forward, but the ball's out of Curtis Smith to launch one forward into Muirhead. Muirhead with a flick over his head as he now moves into the box. Muirhead's free in the box for Worcester. Tackle comes in from Hughes. Flicked up off Muirhead though. That's it. And that, unfortunately, is it. A brave fight back there in the, in the second half from Worcester who got back to just a two goal deficit originally from, uh, from Archie Muirhead's goal. The killer though was the brilliant bit of skill from Stuart Hendry playing Verma through on goal to make it 4-1 to Warsaw Wood.